guys, Mr. Foggy Nights here. Welcome to another episode of uh, Robotech Battle Cry. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm gonna be very, I'm gonna go extra quiet today because uh, I'm really sick. Uh, anyway, so let's move on to the next chapter. The Zentradi were warriors, bred for combat by a race called the Robotech Masters. They were created only for destruction. Human concepts such as music, love, peace, and even recreation were completely unknown to them. As the Zentradi followed the SDF-1 on its long trip to Earth, they were exposed to human culture. In fact, many of them decided to join the Earth forces. Only a handful of survivors remained on the Earth. With limited food and resources, the people endured terrible hardships. They labored to rebuild what we had all lost. Shortly after the Robotech War, I was assigned to Base 6. As luck would have it, my friends Hiro Ishii and Izzy Randall had also managed to survive the war and now served alongside me at the base. Commander Helena Chase was the senior officer at Base 6. She was kind of a taskmaster, I guess, but like all of us, she was anxious to bring our lives back to a semblance of order, to begin again. While on duty, most of my time was spent running patrols out in the wasteland, looking for any signs of trouble. There was a shortage of food, and it was hard to get replacement parts for my Veritech. But I soon discovered that trouble was one thing that would never be in short supply. You see, millions of Zentradi had now been assimilated into human society. And just like humans, we shared some of the same flaws. There were renegade Zentradi who simply couldn't live peacefully with humans. Many of them became scavengers, wandering the wastelands, and raiding human settlements when they needed weapons or supplies. Due to this new threat, the Robotech Defense Force was called upon to protect the scattered communities all over the wasteland. Basically, the war ended, and to summarize what he said, the war ended, Zentradi is active with humans, and they became uh, rebels as well.
get to a safe distance away. Chills, and then I'm gonna stop here. Uh, yeah. And so next episode we will work on Greystone. And this was fun. So see y'all later.